Well, this is what my morning consists of. I wouldn't say morning, it's almost noon. My cup of joe and lots of rain. Lots of rain, guys. It poured last night, thundered, lightning. I didn't really hear much of it, but my wife told me it was pretty bad. And it's been raining all night, and so, and I don't know if you can tell even just by, by right there. But it's coming down. That's not good. I don't think we're gonna get much done today. Got 27 on the list, and there's no way. I got mowing to do, I got gutters to do, but I'm going to go ahead and knock out the quotes that I got to do today. Definitely not just going to sit on my ass home, at home. I'm going to go ahead and do that. <coughs> I'm going to go ahead and do that and um, get that out of the way. Um, I got a couple of them. Uh, I'm gonna go by AutoZone, get some pads for the 09. They're shot, guys. Even when I was when I brought it back yesterday, I didn't mention it in the video, but when I brought it back um, from the dealership, from the repairs, oh my goodness, it was so bad. I like the grinding, I really just hope I don't have to change the rotors. I, I the rain's picking up, guys. I really hope I don't have to change the rotors. I don't think I do. It's not shaking or vibrating. Usually I, my knowledge is when it's shaking or vibrating, they're shot. This is just like you can hear the noise, like the pads are so low. It's like, you know. So I'm gonna go do that. If the rain, I'm not, I'm not changing no brakes in the rain, screw that. I mean, I could bring it in the garage, um, but so I'll do that if the rain slows down. In the meantime, I'm gonna go quote. Um, that's it. Can't you tell I'm happy? <laughs> uh, we're gonna have to work Sunday on this one. Guys, I got 27 on the list, and it's only Thursday. <clears throat> There's no way, and I got Friday, day, you know, Moe's and Saturday Moe's. There's just no way. Anyway, I don't want to make this too long, because I do want to show some other things throughout the day as I'm doing. I just wanted to say good morning, almost good afternoon, basically. Uh, once I, you know, saw the rain, we I contacted, you know, touched base with the guys. I just went back to sleep. So, it is what it is. Oh yeah, here's my bike, guys. Um, I do mountain bike, and obviously not a lot during the summer because I'm so busy. I wish I could. Maybe if uh, maybe I'll do a little bit more bike riding um, when uh, Justin and Steve take a little over. Like, you know, start taking some certain... I wouldn't give them, like, right away a whole day. Or, I mean, a whole week, but, like, maybe a couple days in a week. But I love mountain biking, guys. Um, this is actually brand new. I just picked this up last... Uh, this... Was it this year? Well, I think I picked it up, like, last year, before New Year's. But it was, like, a gift for my birthday to myself. Or from my wife. However you want to look at it. <laughs> uh, one other thing I probably want to get is... See that backpack blower? The reason I left it out there? It's shot. It's broken. Uh, the, the handle up there is cracked, by the way, so I can't even hang it. But that's not the only thing. Like the tip where it sprays, uh, that's shot too. You know, it's it's just, I've had it for four or five years. It's done its thing. I think I bought it at Lowe's for like 70 bucks or something. I don't remember. So I'll probably just pick up another one. I'm 
tempted to go buy like a steel one. Those are like really expensive and nice. But here's the thing, like I need something that I can hang. And I can't hang the steel ones. I need a backpack one that I can hang on my trailer. So, all right, it's already five minutes. Stay tuned, I'll show you what I get into throughout the day. Definitely gonna go knock out the quotes and um, contact some customers. And Oh, got a uh, dental clinic that contacted me and uh, wants me to start maintaining. So I'll show you that, guys, when I go check it out. Um, they contacted me. They said we'd like a weekly service. Uh, we don't have a lot of grass, but a little bit of landscaping and mostly just keeping... Uh, Mostly just keeping like the, the parking lot clean and you know just touch up on the grass and touch up every so often and uh, stop stop and touch up on the on the landscaping. All right, see you later. Another thing I'm gonna go do, I just talked to my dealership and uh, I gotta drop off the walk behind that got the throttle cable busted and pick up the one that had muffler issues it's all warranted both things there's no reason for me to mess with it um, so I am gonna go ahead and I am gonna go ahead and drop this one off pick the other one up I gotta go by Best Buy and see what's up with this GoPro I just made that one clip earlier and I went from 99 percent to 85 something's not right so that and um, quote a couple of things and then the brake pads that's it unless the rest of the day no more rain it's stopped but it's all wet unless the rest of the day completely dries up maybe around maybe around uh, noonish or something we can pop a few and get them out of the way maybe at least gutter cleaning jobs we'll see I'll keep you posted. Stay tuned. Alright, so I'm at the dealership. I dropped off the walk behind that has that uh, throttle switch position busted. So they're going to take care of me in that. I picked this bad boy up and you can see, brand new muffler. They put a brand new one. So that's much appreciated and I don't have to worry about breaking it or cracking it even more or something. So. And while I'm here, I always spend money, right? <laughs> I bought two new wheels um, for the Velke. Uh, I could have just bought the tires, but I think uh, these things in here are, uh, are going bad. It's got some wiggle room, so I just bought the whole rim and the tire. I bought two of them. And... I bought two more heads right here for the weed eater the little caps because they uh, they go real quick bought an extra chain for uh, my pole saw I always like to have everything of two if you've been watching me uh, and watching my videos in one of them I stated I like to have everything of two backups of everything that's just how, I, how I'm used to it and how I've done it because you never know when stuff can go down and you don't want to break down. I don't want to be stopped. I want to be able to finish the job. And then I bought a um, that little new chainsaw I bought. I bought a 16 inch chain as a backup as well. So two chains, two chains, two chains, right? <laughs> um, one for the pole saw, one for the chainsaw two caps and then two uh, rims and tires for the Velky. So that's how we roll today. Oh, and these, uh, they always fall out. So I just put them in, they put them in the bag, but these come, uh, they go, uh, if you didn't know, for so those of you who don't know, I guess, they go in here, see. Oh, anyway. All right, peeps, stay tuned. Catch you guys later. So this is what I ended up getting into from picking up the other mower and dropping off that one with the broken throttle. Look who's with me.
Say hello to y'all. <laughs> and check out, he loves his new shirts. Yeah. Moisture wicking. <laughs> no cotton. No cotton. So it's just me and Steve today. I told Steve, you know, it's a short day. Do you want to come and help me out with a few yards? Because everything is wet. It's been raining all morning. And he said, yeah, man, I'll be right there. So we're just probably going to get about five or ten today. I'm not even stressing over it anymore. I just, it is what it is. We're having such a late start. Um, and I told Justin just to take the day off. So, and uh, he's been really wanting a day off to catch up on his other personal things that he's got going on. And he's been working really hard with me uh, before Steve came back and, uh, and all that. So I just told Justin to stay at home. It's all good. So me and Steve are chuggling along. Whoops, whoops, whoops. And uh, like I said, we're gonna get as many as we can. It is what it is. <laughs> um, getting on the highway. So stay tuned. I'll try to you know show a little bit here and there. And uh, we're actually headed to that big property that's uh, we call it the Black Fence. So I'll have Steve on the Turf Tiger. Yep. And I'll be on the walk behind and we're gonna knock it out and move forward, so. All right guys, just wanted to give you a quick update of what happened since the rain has stopped, the sun has come out and everything is nasty looking. Um, during this time, how you know, when it rains like this, I don't guarantee beauty, but I guarantee it'll be mowed. <laughs> but, uh, all right, catch you guys later. All right, real quick, we just wrapped up this one. This is the big one. Uh, it was just me and Steve. He uh, took care of half of it and, uh, with the Turf Tiger, and I took care of the other half with the walk behind, and we both tackled the uh, inside over there around the house. Didn't have much time to record, really, so it's just me and him, and we're, we started late, and we don't have much daylight left, but Steve, good job, buddy. Thank you, thank you. That was awesome. And um, we're off to the next one. All right. Stay tuned for more. I'll try to record some at this next one. I don't know if I even have that little tripod with me or not. I might not. I'm just gonna put it on the toolbox and then uh, just uh, show it to you guys, you know, how we mow. But let me tell you something. I'm loving these shirts. I mean, I, I'm in love with it. What about you, Steve? I love it. Isn't, aren't these shirts something? They're awesome. Dude, I, I don't know why I waited so long. You know, I've been just ordering cotton shirts for years now. Nine years, really. And I don't know. I, I've heard about it. You know, I was like, ah, you know. But, but you got to keep in mind also, when I was ordering those shirts, that's all I could afford at the time. And then I just got comfortable with the order and I knew how much they were and I just kept reordering them. And, uh, they were expensive, I'm, you know, I've mentioned it to you guys before, it was about $600 for a whole bundle of them. I think, what was it, like 40 shirts or something? Yeah. 40 or 50 shirts, whatever I said before, I can't remember. But, uh, about $15 a shirt. Like basically, about 15 bucks a shirt, yeah, that's with the shirt and then them printing our logo and number and name and stuff like that, so. Um, but it's well worth it. I am gonna go ahead and put another order of five small ones for Steve. Um, he's wearing the medium right now and uh, it fits him fine but it is a little loose on him and I think you'd be more comfortable with a small yeah. seat. This will work for now though. Yeah, it'll work for now. I'll go ahead and tell my wife to put another order in probably next week. So we're going to, like I said, it's 6 o'clock guys. We just wrapped up like 3-4 by now, something like that. Yeah. Heck, that one is considered like three, four yards. <laughs> yeah, because <no one. laughs> <laughs> that's a big yard. And uh, we mowed, we weeded it, and then I uh, I stopped weeding a little earlier and let him keep going because I wanted to go ahead and start the blowing off uh, so we can get done in time because it's it's a big property. So, all right, try to hit a few more. Um, battery seems to be doing good this time. I don't know. Maybe I just didn't have it charged the other night, and I thought I did. That might be the case. Um, anyway, stay tuned. All right, guys, we're at this next one. I told Steve to walk this. There's a little ditch right there. 
as you can see. I told him walk it just to kind of feel for it. I don't know how wet it is or what, because I'm gonna get him on the Turf Tiger again. I'll get to walk behind, but this is the house right here. Uh, it's a bi-weekly. It is a new customer of ours. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and get started. Like I said, it's six o'clock and there's one or two more after this I'd like to get before it gets too dark. So, all right guys. Let's see if Steve gives me a thumbs up. Thumbs up, all right, he's giving me a thumbs up. Talk to you guys later. We are wrapping it up for today. Guys, it is 8.34. There's a spot right there in the front, uh, right there where my finger is. I don't know if it's the deck, or there's like a little, so I let Steve uh, just lightly see, blend it in. Oh yeah, much better. I mean, you can still see it, but. Anyway, it's a wrap, guys. It's 8.30. We've done like seven, eight of them. Considering what time we started, that's phenomenal. Thank you, Steve. Good deal. And we're gonna go ahead and call it a, call it a day. Almost call it a night. Call, call it a night. <laughs> we should just put some uh, headlights in, or lights on our hats, Steve, and, and our weed eaters and mowers and just do a night shift. <laughs> That's double time pay there. <laughs> double time, maybe even triple time pay. Sure, right? <laughs> Can you imagine running a special, Steve? What would we call ourselves? Midnight mowers. <laughs> <laughs> the midnight mowers, the night crawlers. <laughs> oh man, anyway. <laughs> it's been a good day considering what time, like I said, we started. We got like seven, eight done and that includes that big one with that black fence that's considered like three yards really yeah, one. Yeah. yeah more than one so if you were to add that one to like three yards you're looking at like 11 12 yards for today because and we kind of it, it kind of felt like steve we we fly through that one yeah i don't know it just we knocked it out that's for sure i don't know i don't know you think maybe justin's just slowing us down yeah you never know <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just no. kidding. He knows we're kidding. Um, somebody walking. So, anyway, thanks for watching. I'm sorry this is somewhat of a short clip today. I'm gonna put all of it together. But guys, it's been pouring rain all morning. We started late. It is what it is. It is what it is. Say it, say it, Steve. It is what it is. It is what it is. <laughs> Somebody, I'm not even gonna say nothing. Anyway, <laughs> all right guys, take care. See you tomorrow. Oh, one last thing, tomorrow, I'm gonna go ahead and while the guys are mowing and weed eating, probably at one of those big yards where I'm not involved or maybe just one quick medium sized yard. Tomorrow, stay tuned. It's here. <laughs> Anyway, I am planning tomorrow to make the video of how to get more and new clients every week. I'm sorry guys if you can't even see me anymore. How to make more, how to make, <laughs> how to get more clients every freaking week. Tomorrow, that video is coming. And I will share with you guys what I did and what I'm doing may not necessarily work for you, but it may. It may be something that some of you out there are already doing that and you might, you might say, oh, well, that's not really any news to me. Well, if that's the case, then that's great. But this is, I'm only sharing this because in hopes to help somebody who is struggling or wanting to really get their business off, off the ground and really um, could use the help and uh, the advice and you got it? And I am willing to share that and hopes to help somebody. So stay tuned for that. Tomorrow is the day. Like I said, if I plan to do it tomorrow. For, if I don't for some reason, that, that'll be because Steve or Justin screwed up something. Justin. <laughs> <laughs> Justin. And I have to be involved now. But uh, that I am planning on it tomorrow, guys. So um, stay tuned. And I'll explain more tomorrow as far as in depth of it, or what it is, how it works, 
and it's works it works for me and I'm getting new clients Steve are we getting new houses every week every week every week new houses uh, sometimes they're one-time cuts sometimes they're a couple times you know a couple cuts sometimes they're just a couple months and sometimes they're permanent it just depends but uh, anyway stay tuned I'll share that with you guys talk to you later say goodbye Steve see you tomorrow